August is RPG a day month and every day for the month of August there is a new RPG topic and folks will tweet, blog, YouTube and otherwise social media uh, answer their answers to those topics. I will include a link to the site and this image below so that you can join the conversation. Uh, today being August 4th, the topic is what is your uh, most memorable NPC? And I think the most in memorable NPC for many of my games was uh, back when we were playing Pathfinder, we had kind of a reoccurring villain. We met him at level one and he had many run-ins with us throughout the campaign, but he was this big, burly, bearded, cigar-smoking gunslinger guy. And uh, he he wasn't the the rival he wasn't the big bad evil guy for the campaign but he worked directly for that person and they had kind of a darth vader boba fett relationship in that this gunslinger didn't actually care about the cause he was in it because the the payoff suited him best he didn't actually care about the world domination cause that the the actual evil guy was was trying to carry out um but we ran into this guy at level one. We had just killed off a bunch of zombies and my paladin killed a zombie dog. And apparently that was this guy's dog. Part of his deal with the big bad evil guy was that his dog got reanimated. So him and whatever the dog's name was could, you know, live out the rest of their days as pals. And uh, my paladin kind of killed his dog. So he stepped out, had a few choice words to say before... Uh, nearly one-shotting me with his pistol, and uh, uh, despite my high armor class, laid my ass flat. And uh, the party finished him off and scraped me up off the ground, and uh, he he managed to escape, licking his wounds. Um, but we ran into him several several other times throughout the campaign, and. Despite the fact that he completely wrecked me that first time, my paladin was still doing the very paladin thing of, you know, there's there's something in you worth saving. You don't have to be working for the bad guy. You have, you know, lots of talents and there's there's things that you could be doing to make the world a better place instead of, you know, aiding and abetting evil. Um, and he, he didn't really care. And the... The barbarian in the party and I had uh, many uh, times where we butted heads about whether this guy could be saved or not. And unfortunately, the game ended up falling apart uh, before I could save him. But that was like my paladin's secondary goal for this entire campaign was get that get that guy that uh, you know nearly laid me flat, make him see the light, and come around to the if not the good side, then at least stop serving evil. And um, everyone else just wanted to kill him. Uh, but I, I really love the way the DM uh, played the character, did the voice for the character, had him interact with my paladin, had him interact with the other characters before the, the fight broke out. Because we never just saw him and got in a fight. There was always an exchange beforehand. And then he whipped out guns and started trying to kill us. And uh, I just I really enjoy the character. And looking at uh, day number five, who's your favorite recurring NPC? I'll I'll be hard pressed not to have the exact same answer for for day five because that character was such a memor memorable and uh, just amazing character to to keep seeing. So that's my answer for day four. You guys have a good one.